Shalom, 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 everybody. How y'all boy doing today? Happy Sabbath day to everybody. This your boy Terrence the Man. Just call me Big Easy. This your boy Terrence the Man. Hold it down in Chuck Town. Shalom, shalom. All praise to the Most High God for allowing us to live today. Happy Sabbath day. Hope y'all doing well. Hope y'all staying out of trouble. You know, not being out here in the streets, you know, buying stuff for Thanksgiving and buying turkey, ham, and all that. I understand some of y'all got some mothers and fathers and grandmothers and grandparents who still traditionalize in this holiday, buying turkey, ham, and such for this holiday, but you're knowing that it's a pagan day. No matter how much you tell them that it's a pagan day, no matter how much you tell them that it's not for black people and Hispanics and Native Americans, the tribe of Judah and the other 12 tribes, you know, not to be a part of, but they still don't listen. They still won't be as far as the tradition of men. They're so traditionalized, they got to feel like they got to cook. They feel like they got to do something for the holiday, which is unlawful, which is the abomination of the Most High God. You know, we got to understand that the Most High God is very upset with us, especially as black people right now, the tribe of Judah. He's very upset with us because we are not doing the Father's will. We are not following the statutes, laws, and commandments. So we got, we got to do better in life, man. We, we, we really got to do better in that. We, we got to do better. Um, we live in the last days. And it's just a matter of time, you know, for the Most High God to send the sun back to crack that sky. Once he crack that sky, he's going to do judgment among people. So we got to keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, man, it's, it's a beautiful day out here today. And enjoy. How you doing, sir? And uh, get you some fresh air, some sunlight. It's nice, feel like springtime, summertime. You ain't trying to get cold no time soon. But yeah, man, we got a lot to talk about. So much going on in this world. Um, so much going on in this world. We, got, we, got, we need a most high like never before. We gotta stay free out. We gotta stay humble. We got a lot of family and friends who are going on and who you are no more. They're walking away. They um, backstab you, talking trash about you, gossiping, gossiping, gossiping about you. Because you're not around, you don't come around Christmas or Thanksgiving no more. You're not coming around no birthday party. You don't want to participate buying food and, and you know get involved in the holiday spirit with them. You know, because you you're trying to you're trying to be set apart. You know what I'm saying? When a, when a God gives you a wake up call, you gotta separate yourself from them. You gotta be set apart. You gotta move away from them people because those people like that, people like that are going or that are unle unequally yoked can destroy you. Look at the shirt I got on today. Israelite by blood. And I had an encounter with, with this one white man in particular. That's one for store. I just got to take my grandma to the store, right? So, this white man, you know, we know who they are. You know, they're Caucasian. They they're Edomites. They're part of Esau's children, right? So he said, uh, How are you Israelite by blood? Matter of fact, oh yeah, I know. He don't need to call it. I know. I know who you are. And his face got red. But you know what? Y'all ain't, ain't gonna last long. So I, I started to say something smart, right? I said, yeah. I said, if you're going to last long, y'all ain't going to last long. You know, and laugh and walk away. Because, you know, I want to say what I want to say. But I had my grandma right there. If he had would have said some racist slur, and he would have came back. Or something more racist and slur, um, I would have called him a douchebag. Because they don't like to be they call him a douchebag. Oh, man. Well, he, he, he called him a douchebag. But he's eating my, he's a children you saw. So he mad that I woke it. And then I met some brothers and sisters. Well, mostly brothers in the store that say, yeah, you woke my brother. That's right. That's what I talk about. We are, we are the Hebrews. We are the Jews. Jews. I say, that's right, my brother. Um, shalom. You know, that's how you speak to them. That's how you speak to them people. You got you to gotta be sure. You got to let people know who we are. If people don't know who we are, people are completely, completely blind and lost and not in the truth. They're going to be dumbfounded. You know, the Hosea 4 and 6, they might be going to get fired for lack of knowledge. Because,
daughter of Babylon. One evil, wicked country. Read the book of uh, Revelation. We're talking about eight, 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 eight crowns and ten heads. America is one of them. America, Germany, Russia. Some of the Mediterranean countries are part of the free missile program. All of them are part of the equal, the children of Esau. And they're all wicked in, in the Babylon system. Some of these wars that we have, they're about power. Right? Fighting amongst might. Edomites fighting among Edomites. Family fighting their own family. And the Edomites and Esau's children are fighting each other. You know, because they want that power. Some of these World War and World War II don't mean this. This is World War III. It's, it's about a matter of time for judgment from the most high of the sun, Allow the sun and Messiah to come back to, to bring judgment. So all these homosexuals, drunkards, fornicators, boasters, all them things, all them people who so fester the sin, it's a matter of time. They the time will be lined up. The time will be lined up. I've been going through a lot of hell this week here on the job. I'm doing my best to be stress free, keep me in prayer. I pray for you. You gotta stay strong. And know we'll be balanced. The Bible says Ephesians 6 to 12, every wrestling not against special blood. We're punching power of the spiritual which is in higher places. So I know I'm gonna stay strong. Continue to be the salt of the earth. Let the most high me to me be. And continue to keep the faith. Israelite by blood, Israelite by blood, baby. I'm a full blooded Jew. Represent. I will have a good one. I'll let your boy keep God in your heart. Read the Bible, meditate on God's word. There's Sabbath, rest, no labor.